Hi, I'm Tom from Cotswold Outdoor, and this afternoon, well, today, uh, we have just done Vehicle Ridge. We had a pretty windy and a wet start to the day, so I've had my waterproof jacket on all day, so what you haven't seen yet is my mid-layer, and that's the Patagonia R1 Air Zip. So, I'm gonna be very quick, I'm gonna take it off. Better not lose the mat for the way down. The R1 Air is a really versatile piece of kit. It's similar to the R1 in terms that it's micro grid fabric. So what you've got there is sort of um, a net that then the fibers are put onto. So there's a sort of raised bits on it and it promotes breathability and circulation. And then it resists the compression from the waterproof and lifts the waterproof off. So it really helps to move moisture and sort of sweat out and away from your body. This kind of high loft fabric lifts it off the skin. So through all these channels here, all the hot air can escape, but it's still uh, trapping the heat where it needs to. It's beautiful. I love this model. It's got um, just part uh, reinforced cuffs, which means when you put it up, they don't stretch. Uh, so when you want to dump excess heat, you can do. And also one of my favorite features ever is the zip neck and collar. Once again, if I'm trying to dump heat, I can do so really easily. Um, also a nice little pocket where I've had my compass today when I've not been using it. Um, it's a, just a quick, tough pocket over the top that's stitched over the top of the fabric. It is, it's not warm enough for right now, but it is very warm. The, uh, the R1 Air is a perfect complement to Patagonia's famous R1 fabric. So the R1 Air is a little bit different and it's great for activities where you're out all day and you're constantly generating heat because that excess heat can just disappear like my jacket's about to. Um, so come into store, try it on and see if it's the one for you. I really love it. One thing to note about this is that normally I'd be a large, but I've had to go up to extra large on this model. The large did just about fit me, but it was quite short, both on the, both on the arms and uh, the waist as well. So extra large it is for me, unfortunately. <laughs>